So I have these bottles full of loose change and I've always wondered how much money is exactly in one of these bottles or for example how many pennies can you fit in a gallon how many quarters can you fit in a gallon how many and so on so <clears throat> I decided to do a little experiment obviously this is just because I have nothing better to do and I've been trying to Google that stuff, but unfortunately couldn't find anything. So, so here it is. We have a, a little over a gallon of loose change. And then we have a um, sorting machine. It's, uh, it's called the Black Series. And you just pretty much just throw the loose coins in here. And, and it'll sort them. It'll, it'll put them into these uh, plastic containers um, <clears throat> as, as they go. Um, anyway, I, I actually have a little more uh, coins than those two uh, bottles. I've already started the counting process. I have some of them counted. And then I decided to do the video. So I'm going to use these in uh, my experiment too. Those are actually already counted. So first thing I want to do is uh, make this is a one quart okay since I don't have gallons of coins I'm gonna calculate them in quarts <clears throat> so first thing I want to do is uh, count how much loose change is in a quart so what we're gonna do So I calculated <clears throat> three quarts of loose change. The first one came up to $95.64. The second one was $96.91 and the third one was $109.36. So we can probably say that the quart of loose change, unsorted loose change, is right around $100. So you figure a gallon of loose change is about $400. So there we go. Uh, container of pennies. Container of pennies has 1,400 coins in it. 1,400 pennies. That translates to $14.00. So we can safely say that a gallon of pennies is about $56. Well, let's continue. And, and they actually take most space in our pockets. This is after three, three uh, quarts of loose change. We have a full jar of pennies. My quarters are almost full. Um, dimes and nickels are going about head to head. Okay, so let's let's keep going. Now, jar with coins with uh, with quarters is full, so we have eight hundred quarters in a quart. 
that equals to two hundred dollars so if we multiply it by four that comes to about eight hundred dollars in a gallon of quarters one gallon of quarters should have about eight hundred dollars in it so now we have dimes unfortunately I don't have a quart of dimes but I have a half a quart of dimes okay so hopefully it's gonna be fairly close estimate half a quart of dimes is twelve hundred coins that's hundred and twenty dollars so if we want to see how much in a gallon that's times eight that goes to nine hundred and sixty dollars uh, in a gallon of dimes again nine hundred and sixty dollars in a gallon of dimes so now the nickels just like the dimes I didn't unfortunately didn't have a whole quart of nickels but I have a half a quart and a half a quart of nickels is about 440 quarter I mean uh, coins so that would be $22 times 8 if we want to see how much money in a gallon that would come to $176 in a gallon of nickels so again the what we got we would have $56 in a gallon of pennies, $800 in a gallon of quarters, $960 in a gallon of dimes, and $176 in a gallon of nickels. So there you go, a lot of useless data. You will not need it for anything except for just to uh, satisfied your curiosity. I hope you enjoyed my little video. Uh, please rate it um, if you'd like, of course. And uh, have a good day.